Baking bread from scratch can be very rewarding and a way to show that you're serving fresh items on the menu. We will be making fresh yeast rolls. The straight dough method can be broken into 11 steps. This process requires several steps of working the dough, alternating with periods where the dough will rest, so it can be worked into your production schedule in between other recipes. Be sure the mixer is completely clean and large enough for your recipe. Step 1. Scale out the ingredients. Weigh out the dry ingredients and measure out the liquid ingredients. Step 2. Mixing the ingredients. Start with the yeast and the warm water and let them stand for 4 or 5 minutes. Place the flour, dry milk, sugar and salt into the mixer bowl. On low speed, blend the ingredients with the dough hook. Add the oil and blend for about 2 minutes. Next, add the water and continue to blend for another minute. Then add the dissolved yeast mixture. Step 3. Knead the dough. Turn the mixer up to medium speed and knead for about 8 minutes or until the dough is smooth and elastic. The gluten in the bread is developing. Remove the dough from the mixer and shape it into a ball. Step 4. Let the dough ferment. Cover the dough and leave it in a warm area of the kitchen to rise for about 45 to 60 minutes. This stage is known as bulk fermentation, where the flavor of the bread develops. Step 5. Punching down the dough. Pull the dough on all sides, then fold them over the center, pressing down and turning the dough over. This breaks many of the air bubbles. Step 6. Allowing dough to recover. Give the bread a short bench rest after the punch down. Step 7. Portion the dough. For rolls, pinch off 2 ounce pieces. Step 8. Shape the dough into round balls. Spray a full size sheet pan lightly with a quick release spray and then place the rolls in rows of 5 across and 10 down. Step 9. The bench proofing stage. Place the sheet pan in a warm place and let the rolls double in size, which takes about 30 to 50 minutes. Step 10. Baking. For these rolls, it will take about 18 to 20 minutes in a 400 degree oven or until they are lightly brown. Step 11. Cooling. Let the rolls cool at room temperature, preferably on a rack, not on the pan where they would continue to bake from the heat.